Hey everybody, welcome to Takeout Tuesday. Deacon Jim here. Hope you're having a good day. So for today's devotion, I'm taking us to d365.com. One of these devotion sites I've often talked about. And it will challenge, it challenge me, maybe it'll challenge you to think about what we ask of God in our prayers. Um, are we asking too much or often too little? Let's uh, look at this together. God tells us what is good, what is required of us to walk humbly with God at all times and places. Let our hearts be humbled in these next few moments of prayer and devotion so that we may hear anew God's desire for us. From the Gospel of Mark, chapter 10, starting at verse 35, James and John, Zebedee's sons, came to Jesus and said, Teacher, we want you to do for us whatever we ask. What do you want me to do for you? Jesus said. They said, Allow one of us to sit at your right and the other on your left when you enter your glory. Whew. Those are some bold requests from James and John. First, they want Jesus to do whatever they ask. That takes some courage. Then, they go on to ask Jesus to give them essentially the best seats in the house when the moment of glory finally arrives. As grandiose as their dreams seem to be, their request is so very small. They seek the earthly glory of sitting at Jesus right and left when the heavenly glory Jesus offers is so much greater. Living as those who have been forgiven, claimed, and sent to be proclaimers of the message of hope Jesus brings. How often do we do the same thing? How often do we come to Jesus with what we believe are grand requests that, in fact, are so very small. Jesus is open to hearing what James and John want to ask of him, as Jesus is for all of us. Thankfully, as we will see, Jesus is also not afraid to refuse our requests with the intent of offering us something even greater than we could imagine. How true. Let's pray. God of all things, too often I am thinking too small when it comes to all you have to offer. Help me to be open to the true glory you wish to give me. Amen. Servant of God, you are loved, you are holy, you are worthy. Now go in peace, in humility, and in joy to serve the Savior who humbled himself for you. God bless and have a great day.